Not exactly the time to go swimming, little bro. We've got to get to the temple before Hick does. If he gets his hands on the jeweled skull of Akalan, he can bring the dead back to life. Oh, guys, seriously? Why is it my vine that's always the snake? Come on, Edward. All oh, right, I can't fall into a river, but we can stop for Tara to have a vision. Across two mountains, raft down a river, skirt a volcano, cross a ravine, and run 50k through dense jungle. <laughs> or he could just take a helicopter. No probs, we can handle him. It's four against one. Rats! Now it's four against. Probably count as two each, so that's... The odds are still in our favour. Come on! Wait, there's an easier way. There's a small opening in the top. While you two distract the guards, Edward and I will get in that way. Hello? <laughs> Hi, uh, we seem to have lost our way. Can you direct us to the nearest taco stand? Please? This time, we'll be ready for him. I put a tracking device on Hick's helicopter. Once it's cleared Mexican airspace, we can safely put the skull back in the temple. Ooh, yeah! Mission accomplished! So let's celebrate! <laughs> Tacos, enchiladas, and burritos for the senoras and senorita, por favor, Miguel. Si, senor Wellington. Hmm. You still have the skull, Master Charles. Yeah, we're waiting to make sure Hick isn't returning before we put it back. It's fascinating. The skull's power to raise the dead is limited only to this one day every hundred years. So as long as we put it back soon, it won't be a problem. Yeah, providing we don't take it near any graves in the meantime. <laughs> <laughs> that would be a grave mistake. <laughs> <laughs> Gracias, Maria. Besides, isn't today the Akalan Festival of the Ancestors? <laughs> See, we honor our ancestors with decorations, a feast, and a big parade. Well, we wouldn't want to miss that. Yeah! 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 How is the food, Senor Wellington? Muy bien, again. But do you have anything caliente? I would like something hot enough to curl my mustache. Then, you must try my chili. I will see what else is in the kitchen. 
I do love a good hot chili. <coughs> Have you got one? No! Someone's taken the jeweled skull of Akalan! No! What? I wonder if it is true. Can this really bring the dead back to life? I hope so, because I really miss you, Lupita. <sighs> I've been so lonely since you went to God Heaven. <laughs> Lupita, you are alive! But you look different. But I still love you, no matter how bony you are. How touching! Ah! Rosalita! You, you, you're real! Yes, I'm this is mine now. <laughs> Wait a minute. Mmm, sugar! Wrong skull! The jeweled skull is definitely not here, so it hasn't just rolled away. Some dude must have ripped it off. Could it be Hick? Nope, he's somewhere over the Pacific Ocean about now. Then who? Has anyone seen Maria? Uh, that girl has been so distraught since her cat died. Do you know where she might have gone? No, but she is a good girl. She never goes very far. We'll split up and look for her. You two go that way. Henry, come with me. Wellington, you should probably stay here in case she comes back. Certainly, Master Charles. I bet that wouldn't shed much hair. <laughs> this is my cat, Lupita. She used to be dead. What have you done with the jeweled skull? <laughs> we won't be cross, Maria, but we need to know. Rosalita took it. Rosalita? Your friend? You don't mean... <gasps> the Rosalita? Okay. Who's the Rosalita? The Queen of the Dead! According to local legend, Rosalita wants to raise the dead and then, at night, take over the bodies of the living. Uh, excuse me, miss? Can we have our skull back? No! Let me use some of the good old Henry charm. Well, excuse me, miss. That colour really makes your eyes pop right out of your head. I said no! I warn you, we're ready to take it back by force if necessary. Yeah! And you're outnumbered. Not for much longer. said about taking the jeweled skull near graves? Probably something like, bad idea, dude. Here are some nice, healthy bodies for you to take over. Ah! Senor Wellington, I have just the thing to curl your mustache. It is a chili that I call La Bomba Atomica! Hmm. Definitely a hotter, Miguel, but it is still not a mustache curler. Ah, Twiggle! Gracias, Miguel.
Wow! This Rosalita sounds like one scary lady. She certainly is. So I'd better take Maria back home where she'll be safe. <laughs> and Lupita is coming with me. She has to be safe too. Okay. I'll phone Charles and Henry and warn them about Rosalita. They've probably got no idea what bad juju she is. <laughs> you two went hard to find. What with the loud screaming and everything. Don't talk! <laughs> Run! I guess you've met Rosalita then, huh? Yeah, and her bony friends! <laughs> It's a better now. Yeah, three against. Well, they'd only be worth half. So that's two. It's Skinner time! <laughs> <laughs> that rattled their bones a bit. What are you waiting for, Edward? Grab the skull. Uh. My jeweled skull. Oh, right. We have, but I guess they weren't fussy where they buried people in the old days. How many graves are there? <laughs> well, hmm. hmm. A cheeky little tinny with a volcanic aftertaste, but Still, not a mustache curler. Uh, the sun is going down, so I have to get ready for the Festival of the Ancestors Parade now. <laughs> Look, Papa, it's Lupita. That's nice, dear. Did you make it yourself? Uh, sort of. You stay with them while I find the boys. They got away! <laughs> Promised us we could take over their bodies. <gasps> as soon as the full moon strikes the jewel in the skull, we will have the power to assume the bodies of whomever we touch. No way! Yes, way! The only way to undo the curse is to put the skull back in the temple by midnight, when the full moon shining through the shaft will end its powers for another hundred years. We've got to get that skull! Right, so I suggest a three-pronged attack involving distraction, strategy, and the Brazilian martial art of capoeira. Or we could just surprise them. Ah! Edward, wait! Oh, the moon! Give me that skull, you bonehead! with that skeleton. Yeah, and that sombrero does not suit him at all. I've got no muscles. Ah! You are bad as yeah. The village is not far, and soon it will be the festival of the ancestors. Then, vamos! We've got to stop them. What about our bony bro, bro? Tara, you go and warn the villagers. What about her? I just realized. If she touches her skeleton cap now, it'll take over her body. Lupita, where are you? Oh, there you are. Come here, puss. Yeah! Whoa! Whoa. Ah. It's kind of 
hard to fight them without touching them. If you do, you'll end up a nobody like me. <laughs> Instead of just lying there, Edward, can you give us a hand? I can't even stand up. No, I mean, can you give us an actual hand? Ah, sure. You are the dude. Whew. I knew you'd be handy for something, Edward. Hey! Guys, it got me! Charles! You can have my body, but you can't have my shades. Booby really. Too big. Lupita, wait! I've got her! You shall not pass! <laughs> hey! They stole our moves! What did you expect? They stole our bodies! It's skeleton time! <laughs> I've only got seconds before the moon reaches its peak! Coast is clear. <laughs> but we saw you leave. <laughs> Correction. You saw the helicopter leave. But I camouflaged myself to be invisible, so that when the copter took off, I stayed behind, but you couldn't see me. As soon as the smell cleared from the temple, I went back inside and waited for you to return with the skull. Which you have now done! <laughs> so my vision was not about you taking the skull the first time. It was warning me that you would be back to try again! And I have succeeded! <laughs> Nothing can stop me now! <laughs> What will happen to Lupita if I do? <sighs> She'll go back to being dead. I don't want that to happen. I know, Maria. But there comes a time when we have to let go of things in life. Even of our favorite pets. <sighs> Give me the skull.
Oh, yeah! I've got my buddy back! Yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> but not your pants. Oh. <laughs> Mission finally accomplished. And the jewel skull is harmless again for another hundred years. So let's celebrate! Yeah! <laughs> I don't feel like celebrating. Oh, but you did the right thing, Maria. I know, but... Hello, Maria. I've got something here that just might cheer you up. Where? <laughs> right here! Ole! <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's adorable! Gracias, Senor Wellington. I think I will call her Tara. <laughs> This is the best festival ever. We even have a fire breather! <laughs> 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 <laughs>